hey guys welcome back to angular 10 spring boot crude full stack application tutorial series in this video let's quickly have end-to-end -end demo of our angular spring boot crude full stack application and let me recap what are the functionality we have implemented in our employee management application in this series well we have implemented employee list add employee update employee delete employee and view employee features all right let me uh, you know clean all the records from the employee list i mean i will delete all the records and let's have a end to end demo now let's go ahead and let's add a employee to the employee list click on add employee link and here i'm going to add employee that is ramesh employee first name ramesh last name for the email id ramesh at the gmail.com hit submit let's go ahead and let's add one more employee click on add employee tab and let's go ahead and let's add one more employee first name john last name sina and john at the gmail.com hit submit let's go ahead and let's add one more employee let's say admin last name admin email id admin at the gmail.com yeah here we go let's go ahead and let's add one more employee let's say ram and then power ram at the rate gmail.com hit submit great we have added four employees to the employee list now let's go ahead and let's update one of the employee i'm going to update ramesh employee click on update button and let's change first name from ramesh to rama something like this and last name from for the three to uh, Jadav okay and email id from ramesh at the gmail.com to rama at the gmail.com hit submit so look at here the ramesh employee successfully updated earlier the first name was ramesh now it is updated to ram and similarly last name and email id also updated right well Add employee and update employee functionalities are working as expected. Now let's see the delete functionality. I'm going to delete this RAM employee. Click on delete button. Yeah, here we go. RAM employee successfully deleted. Let me delete Johnson employee. Click on delete button. Yeah. John employee is also successfully deleted. Now let's go ahead and let's see the view employee details functionality. Let's say I want to view admin employee details. Click on view button. Yeah, here we go. We can able to see all the admin employee details in view employee details page. Well, if you want to navigate to the employee list page, you can click on employee list tab over here. And if you want to see RAM employee details, you can click on view button. You can able to see all the details of this particular employee in view employee details page. Well, these are the five functionalities we have implemented in this employee management application. Well, maybe in future I will add some more feature to our Angular Spring Boot Crew Full Stack application. Okay, great. So I have created 25 videos on Angular Spring Boot Crew Full Stack application series and I have created a YouTube playlist for them so if you go to the my youtube channel and go to the playlist section here you can able to see angular spring boot crude full stack application playlist if you click on view full playlist you can able to see here all the videos of this particular course are listed here so i highly recommend you guys to go to this playlist and you can check out all the videos to learn how to develop you know full stack application using angular and spring boot well i have already created a github repository on my github profile and i have hosted source code of this angular spring boot code full stack application on my github repository so you can go ahead and you can check out my github repository for example so look at here this is an angular 10 spring boot crude full stack app github repository i have created in my github profile account so whenever you get uh, you know whenever you get any issues while implementing angular spring boot code full stack application you can go ahead and you can check out my github repository over here so this is the working code 
that we have seen through this series this is the working code so whenever you struct anywhere while creating this full stack application you can just check out a source code of this github repository and compare your code with this source code and uh, you can find the issues well angular 10 spring boot crawl full stack app repository has two projects angular front end spring boot back end and this is the readme file i have provided link of all the videos of this series in readme file you can also go through each videos whenever you want you guys can follow me on github usually i will host source code of all the tutorials series courses on my github profile account so whenever i will host source code of any tutorials courses or series you will get notified well i hope this video tutorial series is useful for you guys if you like this course then subscribe to my youtube channel and if you have any queries or any questions let me know in a comment section below so that i will try to clear your doubts all right guys thanks for watching this series and yeah i will see you guys in one more new brand series all right guys thanks for watching i will see you guys in next one